well, in 2014, uh, you and Little Dirk got into it. Yeah. What was that over? Man, Tiger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nah. Tiger, Tiger and Dirk had had some drama. I didn't even know who Little Dirk was, but again, right. man, I, I I pretty much uh, hold myself in this capacity where I'm like anything taking shots at the West Coast, like I'm a live and die for. So. Tiger hit me. He was like, I want you on this song, man. And I, I'm beefing with, you know, Lil Durk. I'm like, I don't even know who Lil Durk is. So I did my research and then I did my verse and then Tiger phased out of it. Then it was just me and Durk beefing. Yeah. And um, that it was short lived, man. I, like I said, uh, me and Durk, we had we exchanged a few words on wax. Um, I ran into him at this Rick Ross party and uh, we had mutual, you know, mutual homies. So we squashed it there. On video, it looks like, you know, whatever people thought it was. It looks, they saying Drake, I mean, Dirk came to L.A. and he punk game. And but, no, I remember, yeah, it was at the Supper Club, I think. No, 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 it was downtown. At, uh, was it downtown? Okay, because I remember I interviewed Dirk right afterwards. Right. And me and his brother kind of became cool during this time. Right. But it seemed like a whole bunch of nothing. A few days ago, a video came out where you and Game were in the club arguing. But then the next day, there were some tweets from both you and Game, clearing up the whole situation. Yeah. So, so talk about, you know, what happened between the club and the tweets. Um, it, it, it was the club scene it was more like, that's our first time seeing each other. That asshole was tension. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He had t his people had tension, we had tension. So we just brought it to the middle of the club, called a big ass scene. But at the end of the day, it was street politics. So what happened after the club? Um, next morning, a couple of the big, like, older guys out here, the old school guys out here, put us on a three-way call. We saying we squashed and squashed and it. Basically, it, wasn't, it ain't no big story to it. It wasn't nothing. And uh, I saw Dirk at uh, at uh, Drake's concert, like, uh, I don't know, a few, like a month or two back. And we laughed about it. We chopped it up. Yeah. And we uh, we jumped on live and we and we was cool. But I fuck with Dirk, man. Dirk is... Dirk is a real a, a real nigga, and I love I love everything he's doing. And like and like I said, he uh he just he stand on business, and he know I stand on business. So at that at the end of the day, it's just you know we just gonna let it be what it, whatever it was, which is bullshit.